Hacker Girl is an event where girls from private schools can come together and code their own game. It's really fun because um, you get to code from scratch. You start with this program called Game Salad, and it's really fun. Hi, I'm Erin Carmody, and I work with Hacker Gal. I was the educational consultant. I'm also a lady in tech, which uh, has inspired me to come on um, and do work for this project. I've been working in education for a long time, seeing that there's a gap between um, the education that girls are getting in middle school. So when they go to high school, um, when they get to choose their computer science electives, they haven't had as much exposure to computer science as a topic or coding as a language or what it can really do. So we wanted to do that in middle school so when girls get to high school they've had exposure and they will hopefully choose a computer science elective. Our game is a robber tries to escape into a portal to get to the next level and the cops trying to chase the robber while it's happening. So the person playing the game will be playing the robber and they're trying to get to um, like the portal that we've created that will take them to the next level without bumming into any of the barriers which will take them back to the beginning of the level and are basically trying to progress through the levels. So some of the things that I've learned today were about the rules that we had to create. If you were trying to tell the computer to do something, you'd have to say what's going to happen and how that will affect the next thing that comes after that. So if the robber bumps into the walls, then the game will reset. As a teacher in the room, it's been a fascinating experience being a part of this because I'm not doing any teaching, but there's amazing learning going on here throughout the whole day. The girls have truly been remarkable in just jumping into this program that they have no prior experience with and really working together to figure it out and in the process, let their imaginations run free, think about all the different possibilities for the games that they can create with the these tools and using the writable surfaces over there to brainstorm their ideas and create something. That's been really amazing to watch.